I make my bracelets handmade, obviously. I went to a store and I saw there was beads and I thought I could make some bracelets. I saw that my brother was having like a hard time and he was getting sick a lot. I wanted people to know that he has sickle cell because he wasn't feeling comfortable telling anyone. She's always looking for something to do. She does not like to be sitting at home doing nothing. She came up with this whole idea by herself to make the bracelets to bring awareness for sickle cell disease for Isaiah. He's going through something that's really hard for him and he, sometimes he misses out on stuff and I wanted him to like feel loved and when he's like in a crisis, there's someone there for him. The crises can vary. Sometimes it could be something on the smaller side where he is uncomfortable but able to maintain the pain with ibuprofen and Tylenol. Or it could be a severe crisis where he is totally out for the count. He is in excruciating pain. Uh, sometimes morphine and oxycodone don't work. Um, sometimes he is in so much pain that he just literally will cry the entire night through. It's really hard to see your own child in this type of pain, but you have to push through that and put a smiling face, especially when you have other children in the house. Lily is the GOAT caretaker. She can take care of Isaiah in a crisis. She can take care of her three-year-old sister. She could take care of her 18-month-old brother. She's just really caring and courteous. She's just a really good caretaker. Lily literally came up with Better Beads one day and just started it. She thought, well, maybe he'll be more comfortable if more people just knew what sickle cell was. Let's make these bracelets and let's show awareness and teach people what it is. Let's put the red beads and regardless of what color your bracelet is, it's always gonna have the red beads at the end and allow the conversation to start and bring more awareness and allow our warriors to feel more comfortable in their own shoes. I wear them at school all the time. I post some pictures of me doing the blood drive and then people see that and they want to order more. I try to donate to this company called Next Step and they have like sickle cell patients and I thought I could donate to them since I know them from my brother. She just followed her heart and that is like a huge lesson that she taught me.